Okay, so we're gonna be playing this. Sorry, last time I keep making the mistake on my controller because it uses A and Y instead of A and B to do things. So it's A. I may as well put the A and B R because I'm used to it differently, so. Whoa, he gets launched off the bed. Wow. Oh, so I gotta come back here. Oh, this thing that. Now, I'm looking for someone, okay, I'm looking for somebody to help, or someone to make ukulele 64. Um, if someone can be able to reload, re make, based on this engine, make a ROM hack to utilize them, because I've seen them put Mario in there. So, if you guys could re, do it to put Yuka and Lele in all the levels exactly, um, that would be awesome. I'm I'm also looking forward to a few ROM hacks. Uh, Banjo Kazooie Return. Uh, Mario sixty Mario Odyssey sixty four, Breath of the Wild sixty four, which is just basically Ocarina of Time with some textures that look like they're from Breath of the Wild. Uh, I'm also looking forward to Mario Sunshine sixty four, and I'm also looking forward. Do a few other things. Let's go to the Growling Garden because that's the first one I'm close to. I do like Banjo Kazooie as a game. I've not really played it, to be honest. But that's not, that's due to when I was born. I was born kind of in a roar, in a place where I really couldn't play it. Mainly due to... Being in the age demographic, which wasn't born around the time of this game being around. And I'm kind of sad that, yeah, Rare did buy out. Rare was bought out by Microsoft, because I think Nintendo should have decided, hey, let's actually buy off this game. Um, That was an enemy? That was an enemy? I thought it was someone you had to talk to. That was my understanding. Oh. Cause I'm not, I'm, uh, you, you might see me die here quite a lot. I'm not keen on this camera positioning. Whatever was up with that? Oh, I can't go that way. Dang it. I'm not, and I'm using a controller, like, not like an N64 controller or anything. So I don't know where the thing is. Ah!
I did hear about, about some bad reviews for this game, to be honest with you, and I wanted to give the benefit of the doubt of being an actual, like, true successor. I'm surprised that Microsoft has given up with Rare and making them... They were good, and I, I think they could have had some good potential still, but I don't think Microsoft needed to buy them out. I don't really think that was something that needed to happen. I don't know how to climb up these trains. Is it this button? Ah, fudge. Sorry about that. I'm trying to figure out how I did one move. Because I don't like this weak jump and, and I don't like the dark aspect of it so I'm just gonna leave them in and the thing is in this game you have to go back and collect them all but yeah, that's the thing like one person said you have to learn all the moves I was like yeah but uh, I said hey I'm not one to judge um, if you guys want me to play the original Banjo Kazooie, I will, I will, but you gotta give me a chance to learn how the game works and everything, you know. An enemy! It's an enemy! But, you know, I'm, I'm giving this the benefit of the doubt, um... I died. Mainly because I don't know how to play the dang game. Like, I've seen people play the game and love the game. But Banjo-Kazooie is still a good game. I don't know about Nuts and Bolts. I was thinking of giving that a shot sometime, because I heard that game is pretty bad. Like... Because if somebody could make a ROM hack version of ukulele, that would be really cool. The reason I like that is because I'm going to work on a video as soon as a lot of these different ones. Like, I'd like a ROM hack of Yoshi's Crafted World, and that comes out done in Yoshi's uh, story and everything like that. So, I want it done like that. So I'm going to come traverse the land here and see what I collect. I did see there were some collectibles, but I got to learn all my move sets and... All of that, let's see. Okay, so that does that.
And I don't know why Rare got bought out by uh, Microsoft. Nintendo should have done it because, like, <sighs> why take something so amazing and make it horrible? Is my question. But what I would actually like for someone to do is redo Banjo-Kazooie, but instead of, like, Banjo and, like, put maybe, like, Ratchet and Clank or Kerr or, like, Kirby. Like, what I would like is for, like, Yoshi. Because I think they could have, out of anything, Banjo, Kazooie, I think that's cool. Ukulele is a great game. I haven't played it. I love to play it. The main reason I haven't played it is due in part to not having enough of what you guys call the greens, the moolah. He doesn't jump high. I, I don't know how to use the bird. I don't even know if I can. What I'd like Nintendo to do is create their own rare. Why can't I get the collectible? There we go. Now, if you could put Donkey Kong and have, like, Diddy Kong or, like, another creature come, that'd be, oh, that'd be sweet. I don't know what else to do, because I don't know where to go or what to do. And I, I, I would like to work on making a few different ROM acts. Like, <laughs> this is a pretty cool one. That's all I'm supposed to be the grab. Get away. I don't like you. I don't know how to defeat enemies. If there's a way, let me know. Because I can't do it. Because this game is like, it's like horrible to control the camera. Like, if that's how Banjo Kazooie is, I know it's like praises being one of like the best N64 titles. Beating Mario 64 altogether. But really, come on, like, 
I'm not. I now I might try out Bubsy 3D. That's what we need. We need Bubsy. Let's put Bubsy in this game. Let's put Bubsy should have been done as a Banjo Kazooie type game. Just saying, it would it would have been really cool. But I know this game came out before this game, so technically Banjo Kazooie is better than Bubsy 3D. Keep falling down. I mean, the only way to get around that enemy is to actually have to be able to jump over there, because I can't. I obviously can't kill enemies, which to me, in a game, you're supposed to be able to kill enemies. Like, like in a game like this, you're supposed to be able to kill enemies and all that. Now, if there's a way to make the auto, the camera be auto followable, like it, how the camera could follow Banjo in the game, that would make it a little bit better for me because it might be just the controller I'm using. But I will try to change the button layout to fit my controller, or I will try this. With, I don't really like using these games with on-screen control. I might look if there's out there a Bluetooth. U.S. like N64 control. If there is, let me know. Um, sorry. See the controls. Um. And that's all I can get is those two, because there's nowhere else I can go in the in the land in the traversing the land because I can't get any where further in the game. I don't know if it's because it's a bad game or I'm horrible at these, but I think that's I don't know.
No, I keep falling off because it has... This camera is so messed up. I think that's where I'm going to end it.